congratulations, Gemma, on being named the Equestrian Australia Young Athlete of the Year for 2017. Yep, it's a great honour. Um, being the first time I've ever been nominated for an award, let alone receive an award, it's amazing. Yeah. It was a big year for you, 2017, capped off by winning the Australian Eventing Championship at Equestriad on Annapurna, a mare you have a great rapport with. Yes, uh, last year was a big year for me and Anna. Uh, yeah, we uh, came first at the Australian National Championships uh, and competing at Oceana, um, winning the Young Rider was amazing, working in a team environment, that being my first time and first time representing my country, was an amazing experience. I'm sure it was because you've grown up watching your father represent Australia on all sorts of level, including the Olympics and in fact winning a gold medal. So to now be following in his footsteps is exciting for you. Yeah, it's very exciting. Um, now we're sort of competing at the same level as well, which is pretty exciting. Um, it's great to have him there in the same level as me and yeah, it's good. How much do you aspire to emulate the achievements of your father, Stuart, in the saddle? Um, as best as I can be, really. I want to, I, I would love to be as good as him. And I think with his help, I'm hopefully going to get there. He's played a big role in my, in my riding and, and so is mum. They've been great. They're there with me every day, coaching me every day and keeping an eye on me. Yeah. Riding is your full-time focus and coaching is a big part of your day-to-day -day life as well, Gemma. Yeah, I really like coaching. I've got my level ones uh, recently, so I've been... Uh, teaching a lot of uh, students which I love doing I love it a lot yeah what do you love about the sport so much um oh, the people are just great you know we all get along and we can all be friends and compete against each other it's um, a great environment to be involved in